right, I'm going to do a how-to video on how to complete accelerated math. Students come into my class and get their folders, and then they begin working on their practice or tests on accelerated math that they had on the previous day. These are math skills that they're working on, each and every one of them. As they complete their accelerated math, they put it on a Scantron. Let me see. Just like this. Then they take that Scantron back to the back, and they put it into our scanner. Okay, they sit there and wait for the computer to process it. And then they grab it and wait a few minutes for it to print on the printer. Then students have automatic feedback on how they did on their accelerated math. She did a great job and made a B on hers. Then she's able to correct those few. She's going to staple them like she's supposed to together. And then she takes those back to her seat. And then she is going to correct the two that she misses. And then I check them as they finish. While she's doing that, other students are just continuing to work on their accelerated math until they finish. And it's their time to complete theirs. There you see another student going to the back to score his accelerated math. So they just get up when they need to to go score it. On Fridays, if they do really well, they get to play math games on the computer once they get a passing, game, uh, passing grade. So we have two students right now working on math games on the computers while the others just continue to work. Hopefully this helps you on how to show a student how to complete accelerated math and then how they score them.